FFG stand here uh, at AMB 2018. Now, under their umbrella, they supply the Leadwell range of machines. Of course, in the UK, Lead Precision Machine Tools are the supplier. You may know their machines for their, their VMCs, their machining centres, uh, their turning centres, five-axis machines, but do you know them for this style of machine? Uh, Stefan, can you just give us a little bit of an overview of what we have here behind us from Leadwell? Yeah, here we have got a Leadwell TW8 machine. It's a double spindle horizontal turning machine. Um, we are using this machine for doing two operations on a high precision part of a bearing housing for torque chargers. So what's the, um, the, the, the differences or the benefits to having a machine laid out and configured like this with the, the two spindles facing the front as opposed to opposing each other? Um, it's a very compact building. It's a very small machine and um, the value compared to the, to the cost is a very good ratio. And we can do the two operations you have on a bearing housing with one spindle each other and the loading is just from the front, so you don't have you have very easy access to the machine. Everything's also very visible, isn't it, as well? You can see what's happening. Yeah, I mean, you trust the machine implicitly anyway, but it's good to see what's happening in there. So, so one spindle is being fed by the, uh, the gantry loader, correct? Yeah, we have a uh, separate gantry loader on top of the machine, which feeds both spindles. Between the two spindles, there is a, a, a part changer. It's changing the part uh, setup, so we can move it from one spindle to the other one. Okay, now each side is equal, is it? Have you, have you got a, a turret either side as well with X amount of stations? Now the spindle itself is the, sa is the same, but the operation is different. Okay, the operation is different. What about, what about the turrets on these machines as well though? Are they equal? You've got two it's of just them. Just a chuck that is different because you have a smaller diameter on one side and a bigger on the other side. But the turret that's actually doing the turning, you have two turrets on the machine, yeah? How, how many stations do they have? Each turret has got eight stations and you can have it with driven tools or with just turning tools. Where do you see the market for this type of machine then? I mean, is this an automotive component? Is that the type of part that you'd be looking to manufacture? Yeah, this is a part of a turbocharger, a high volume turbocharger. So it's maybe 500,000 parts per year. And uh, this is for the tier one and the tier two market. A, a, a reliable machine, this one. Fairly new to Leadwell. Is this a new model? This, is, this model is on the market maybe a few years, three years. But it's a very reliable machine. It's, it's not too complicated. So you can easily maintain it by yourself. Uh, I also noticed that you've got a Siemens control here. Uh, so often in the UK, Leadwell machines come with Fanux. Uh, this is obviously an option too, and popular here in Germany. Uh, so we are proud to see that it's the first uh, TW8 with a Siemens control. We are on a German fair here, so we, we like to show the Siemens control here. Now, we can obviously identify this part as having milling on it, but you're not doing the milling on this machine, are you? But you could do. You could have driven tools here on this machine. We have driven tools, but we can only in one angle use them in 90 degrees. So for the milling operations and the five axis operations, we have an opposite uh, turning center, a Speck 450 Duo with two spindles, which is all doing the residual machining and uh, milling machining. Okay, brilliant. Thank you very much, Stefan. So what, what I'm gathering here is this type of machine is ideal for parts like this. Two operations, one side, then turning over to do the second side. It fits in a very small footprint, as you'll see behind us. Eight inch chuck, it's got turrets either side. You can have it with mill drill, uh, perfect solution. Thank you very much for your time, uh, Stephen, thank you.